everybody, I'm the Tritoner, and you are watching Let's Play Coma. Coma is a game from Atmos Games. Atmos Games was founded in 2009, and this was their first game that came out in 2010. Uh, it seems to me like the common denominator between all of their games is originality. And I haven't played any of their games, but I have seen them played. I've seen little tidbits and... What I really love is that uh, they're all really original, and even if it gets a little bit weird, it's very indie, it's very cool, very original, and the, the soundtrack, uh, just from what I, I could tell from like demo videos and other things that I've seen about these games, uh, the soundtrack is really good, and I love that about a game because it just creates a whole sense of cinematic atmosphere, you know? And I, I just love a good, a good game with a good atmosphere, even if it's a bad game with a good... Um, a good soundtrack. It, it just, it's just awesome. But anyway, here we go. This is Coma. Oh, okay. Do, would you like to play the piano? Sure. Let's do it. Yeah. Yeah. That's that's that piano proficiency coming back to me. Yeah. Yeah. Get my degree in this junk. Okay. Okay, that's enough of that. Here we go. I don't, I don't know how that was <laughs> that was pertinent to the game. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, shadows. Shadows with a with a real like light source. That's awesome. Wait, what what did that say? This is swirl is a lie, of course. Okay, whatever. Whatever you stay, man. Uh, no objective so far. And my character is moving without me indicating any kind of movement. Okay, here we go. Here we go. What does it say? Um. Ring the doorbell. With door spelled. Oh, so cutely wrong. Or or that's a J. Ring the doorbell. What was that? Oh, well. Okay, here we go. Pete, it's Bird. Hover. For some reason, the bird has a has a southern accent. Pete, it bird, get yourself over here. Hey, bird, what up? Dad locked me up in this stupid cage so I wouldn't tell. Tell what? He locked your sister, your sister in a se okay in a secret basement. He says he wants her to starve. A what? Yes. So whatever you do, don't tell him you know or he'll lock you up too. Now get me out of this cave and let it go rest of your sister. Oh, your sister. Uh, I, I'm, I'm guessing I'm like a hamster thing. What is going on with the black squares? Okay. What, what, what does this guy have to say? Where? That was a weird. <laughs> That's neat. Where do you think you're going, son? Nowhere. Well, then make yourself useful and go and find out what is clogging the drain. Did you take a big again <laughs> it's probably fat Simon actually I know it is okay w whatever whatever actually I I, I know it, it is too I I've, I've seen that this part of the, of the game played so N none of this is really a huge surprise red wing red oh red wind field okay here we go okay Hey there, giant eyeball, or giant, that, <laughs> I don't even want to discuss what I think that looks like. Here we go. <laughs> My name's John, but I'm a girl, because this is a postmodern game. Yeah, hey, John. Listen, fella, have you been to the shill bin? Uh, no. Say that left is right and right is left down there. Too scary for you, I bet. Cool. See what I mean by this? This game is just very indie. Like, it's... It just has that indie vibe about it, and I love that because so many uh, Flash games, this is a Flash game, um, so many Flash games have platforms that you suddenly can't stand on, have just such a, a bad sense of originality, you know? Wow, wow, wow! What is this? Hey up here, do you see me? Uh, I guess. Le it's none of your business look at me, the Madagum boys. Uh. Leave now. Okay, whatever. Can I can I swing on these? Can I hit down or spacebar or enter or shift? No. Nope. Can I control with anything other? Okay. 
Oh well. Pop the strawberry right in half. Can I gonna pop these strawberries? Strawberry! Strawberry, pop it! Okay, here we go. Whoa. Oh, th there was a hole back here. Okay. And the birds flying by? This is such a cool, dynamic game. Am I... Who's stuck? I'm stuck? Oh, oh, th th this is the guy. Okay, this this is Simon. Simeon. Whatever. Isn't it obvious? No. I explain it. <laughs> well, it's a cup with dirt in it. I call it cup dirt. I have hypoinflation <laughs> disorder. I inflate randomly. Perfect. What can I do to help? Get a sharp thing. It's the only... You want me to stab you? Okay. Whatever. Um... These are probably sharp things. This is like a metal pipe, right? I can... Okay, uh, that's clearly not the answer. Let's go back over here. I, d I didn't really look at any of the stuff over here. This... Looks like the music is fading out. Does, does that mean anything? Or is that ju just a an area thing? Okay. Man, those birds are so cool, huh? No, I want to see if, if it does that, that again if I go back. Burn! 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 Bur okay, that's enough of that. Moving right along. Can I pop these strawberries? Yes. Pop them strawberries. Right in there, strawberries. Pop your strawberry right in your strawberry. Okay, here we go. Even the flowers, like, move over, like, flower, flower, flower. You know, I just, I love, like, whenever you, you walk through, like, an area in a game, and the there's a real sense of of d dynamic I, I don't know but it just it's neat it's so neat you know like like the wind like the flowers respond to the wind and you walk over the the flowers and they respond to you and like like in this whole area that's how you know where, where your character are or where your <laughs> where your character are where your character is because you know you're going in behind this I saw that black square I don't think that that's supposed to be there. I think that's just a glitch. Anyway, but like you're behind this hay or this grass or whatever. Like, is there anything sharp in this? Oh, the the hook. Okay, the hook. All right, here we go. Is that a person? Is that a person up there watching me? Like in the window? Anyway, was it clogging? <laughs> was it clogging the bottom? Yeah, fatty fat cakes. Pop fatty pancakes. With this here fishing hook. Alrighty. Are you lowering it down? Okay. Let's grab that. Oh, oh, my little friend is carrying it. That's neat. That's neat. Like, what am I? I, I saw that. What am I? I'm, am I just like a, like a hamster? Go, go past the ominous looking orifice in the ground. Pop some strawberries on the way up there. Okay, this this is the thing that was weird before. I can't jump on it until I jump on it. I I don't understand. Anyway, here we go. Pop the strawberry. Bam. Oh wait, hold on. No, that's fine. Okay, here we go. Can I can I pop you now? So the hook I see. You bet it is. You must stab me. Okay. <laughs> Eww. Eww. How abundantly relieving. Thank you, friend. Thank you. You're, you're welcome for stabbing you in the in the face. Here we go. Okay. What, what what can I do? Can I can I jump? Whoa. Okay. I, I guess that was supposed to happen. Anyway, here we go. Can I go up? No. Can I jump up? No. Oh well. Here we go. Into the abyss. Wake up, Pete. Yeah, sure. Let's do it. Let's do it. You grab that lat. You grab that lat. Here we go. Oh, I have to jump up for you to grab the lat. You, you can fly. I can fly. You can fly. Ooh. See, it, it just... This would not be the same without the awesome music. Can I jump up here? No. 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 Uh. No. Okay. Can I? Oh. 
No. 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 Okay. Can I? Am I? Is gonna walk inside of you now? All right. Whatever. Can, can I walk out of you? You you don't mind me just just meandering through? What does that say? Bring. Bring. T. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. Bell. Door. The doorbell. Uh. Oh. See, I knew that that looked like a like a something nasty. What do I do? Do I just? Oh, that is what I thought it was. Oh, it's a butthole. Oh, I wanted to avoid saying it because I mean I, I don't know who's watching this, but <laughs> it was a butthole the whole time. <laughs> okay. Do I take this back to my my friend over here? Nope. Nope. There's nothing I can do with this. What do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Okay. I found this thing in this guy's butt. Can I can I go back down into his butt? Okay, I guess not. I love this music. Papa Strawberry. I'm not really even sure how long this game is. I would really ra why do you look different? Oh, is, is my light attracting your your magnetic thing? Okay. Um, I don't really know how long this game is. I I would assume I could finish this in one one take. I, I really don't want to make this like a multiple episode thing. Birds, but like if I have to, I will. But like, I would just rather not. Wait, can I jump? Oh! Oh! I got you. Alright. You, you know, Pete. Oh, I'm Pete. We could definitely turn around. What, what happens if I if I say no? Okay, we're gonna die. Yep. Here we go. Well, why am I suddenly attracting things? Or is that, that, that just the wind that's making these things blow? Okay. Shill bin. Oh, oh, left is right. Okay, okay, but that doesn't mean right is wrong and wrong is left. I I don't know if that was indicative of a future interaction, or if that's that's just it. The just the game's weirdness, which I I love the game's weirdness. Like, oh, b oh are those bodies? Are those more hamster bodies? No, thank you. Okay, I, I wonder if I could just turn my keyboard. No, all right, well, whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm good enough to do this. Okay, clearly, clearly, I should not be be doing let's plays. Okay. Just, no, okay, no. Jump. I'm good at this. Here we go. Oh, spider. Okay, now, now left is right. That song, we know that song. We do? Yeah, your sister used to, your sister used to play that song all the time. Is that my, my sister right right there? Can I just get to it right there? I wonder if those are actually the notes. Cool. Was this a trampoline? Yes. Yes. This game was already worth it. Yes. Okay. Moving right along. Oh, I can't move right along. How do I... How do I do... How do I trampoline? Do I jump onto something? Do I go under the trampoline? I can't go under the trampoline. Okay. I wonder if I just get... If I just stand on it. Or I, if I press down and up a lot. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, I, I don't think pressing down and up helped, but I'm just gonna keep jumping higher, higher, and higher, and higher. This does not seem like logical 
sense making. Okay, I, I'm guessing I have to land on this cloud. Oh, yeah. This doesn't make sense either, but okay. Whatever. Okay. I was expecting that. Oh, you gave Mama Gumgasa quite a start. You woke my heart. What is your name and we'll play a game? Alrighty. Pete, I've been waiting for you. Really? That is creepy. Yes, yes, you see, your your sister wants me to tell you she's fine. Your sister's fine. Uh, you talk to her? Yeah, I saw her playing with my son Gumboisha this morning. I, I see you, Black Square. But I thought she was in my dad's secret basement, which is also creepy. Nope, she just danced. So stop whatever you're doing forever and go play gum gosh a ball with my son gum boss. Okay, whatever you do, don't ring the doorbell. It's um bad luck. Now just run along. Yeah, that that's not sketch. Okay. Um, can I do anything with your fat rolls right here? Can I walk through you? I cannot walk through you. I didn't acquire anything from that. I don't know. That woman is a straight up liar. Yep. So what if I go back? Can I, can I scare her again? I see you. Can I just jump? Can I jump? Can I jump somewhere else? That didn't make any sense. I don't think I, I can go back up there. If so, well, no, I'm I'm going a little bit higher, kinda, 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 kinda. Okay, I don't know what's backdrop and what's not. Hold on, hold on. Here we go. Just one more, one more. Okay, two more. Can I go the other way? I cannot. And somehow I fell on the other... Whatever. Okay. What's that thing? It's a spider thing. Okay. Now everything is back to being left and right. Can I, can I go down in this? This is a well? Okay. Whatever. Um... Okay, now things are back to being left left is right. Whatever, I don't care. Okay. Can I go? No. Okay. Is anything changed? I didn't acquire anything from that interaction. Wake up, Pete. <laughs> okay, now that I know that I am Pete, it kind of changes things. I, I thought that, that Pete was just... I don't know. I guess I'm just stupid. Whatever. Hi. Let me let me go into your innards. Bring door. Where was there a doorbell? Oh, oh, there was a house. Can I? Can I? Oh, all right. I'll just jump out of the butthole. Can Can I grab this again? Okay. Yeah. So ho that the horse has a house right there. Okay, can I ring the doorbell? Is this a doorbell? What doorbell? Secret basement. Can I jump on top of the house? I cannot. Is there a doorbell on this side? No. No. I can't do what? How do I proceed? Okay. Okay. Honestly, I, I haven't even, even been tr keeping track of, like, the amount of time I've been doing this. So I'm, I'm just going to get as far through this game as I, as I can. Because I don't see a way to save. So it can't be that long. I'm clearly just inadequate. Oh. 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 Duh. Okay. Here we go. Hey, let's play. Whatever. Of course. But you need... Jump seeds to play. Eat and be light as a feather. Eat seeds. Thanks for the 
seeds. So the goal of the game is simple. Jump on that red fruit and fly. There are other fruits in Ridwind Field. And even in your dad's basement. Why does everyone know so much about my dad's basement? What's going on in there that I don't know about? Oh, I can jump super high now. Yeah. Can I ride these? This doesn't make any sense. Okay, I can now jump super high. Which also does not make sense. Can I jump over this? No. No. Sure can't. I'm gonna have to go through the sewer again. I don't care about this! Oh! I've gotten everything I need from this. Gonna go back through the worm's butt and have to do go back the other way. Hi! This worm sure is awfully passive to let me just pass through his innards like this. Here we go. Thanks. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, can I can I jump back? I bet I can jump back onto the dock thing and then go the other way. Or onto the house? Nope. Jump. Oh, oh okay. Okay. Oh. Ring the doorbell. Beep. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. What was it? It was, oh. Okay, what was it? It had D's and G. I should know this. I, I'm a musician. There's nothing else I can even do. Oh, don't, don't tell me I have to go back through this. Oh, okay. I might just, just jump cut this or just make you all sit as I watch. I mean, watch as I you know what I'm saying as I go back through the through the whole game to get back to the thing see her song or whatever and then I go back to the piano and I play it and then it's all good and maybe that's the, the doorbell like maybe the doorbell is broken and that's the tune that the doorbell rings and that was weird Redwind Field Still, it it doesn't d discount from the from the game. I, I did read one comment where someone said something about the logic was kind of sparse, but that's any game. Like, come on, it's any indie game. That's that's part of being an indie game. It, it has to make a certain amount of nonsense, or else it would not be an indie game. Am I right or am I right? Okay. I'm not gonna go back in into the the worm's butt. There we go. Okay, I wonder if I can jump higher on the trampoline now. Can I jump through this now? Nope. That's okay. Okay, D E B A B D E E, B, A, B, okay. Let's see if I can jump any higher on this trampoline now and see if it, I don't think that this is gonna help me at all. Unless I can jump over that, that thing now. Oh, oh, it takes so long. Bounce, bounce, oh. Bounce. Oh. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna stop. <sighs> so anyway, just waiting whilst I bounce up to the sky place. Oh yeah! Can I jump over you now? Or is there an invisible wall? There is. Of course there is. Of course. 
Yeah. D A E B A B. Neener, neener, neener. D E B A B. Go all the way back to the piananer. To the piananer. D E B A B. Squash a strawberry. Thanks for your help, dude. These seeds are trippy. Just hopping. Just hopping. Hop past the butthole. Hop in. Where am I? Okay. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. Hop right. Nope. Hop right into the house. Here we go. Ring the doorbell. The doorbell. D E B A B. If this doesn't do anything, I'm going to be so mad. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Get you some. Pete? Yes. I lied to you. Who lied to me? Who lied to me? Who be banging? Where? What? Can I grab this light? No. What was that? Okay. Alrighty. Maybe I need to go get that light again. I, I really, really don't want to do that. So far away now. Um, here we go. I do not know. Uh, off camera, I tried to go back and get the light from the the innards of that worm thing, and I didn't. I couldn't get back up there. So, oh well. Can I jump down? Why? Is this like this? What is that? What? Is, is, is this my father's... Wait. Pete, do you see it? The doorbell is up there. Go ring it. Why is the doorbell in the friggin' thing? I'm excited to see you, Pete. Excited for who to see... Oh, that was the only strawberry. No, I can. Um. Pete, your eyes are opening. <laughs> You'll see me soon. Then. You mean I did all of that? <laughs> I could have just kept on going? <laughs> okay, well, whatever. Well, uh, okay, so uh, commentary time. Wait, sound effects by my mouth and free. <laughs> he made all the sound effects with his mouth. Okay, anyway, um, thanks for playing. That's a really cool concept for a game. I. My assumption, of course, based on, on the title and what was going on in the game, is that you're you're in a coma and that this is kind of like the nonsensical dream stuff that's happening. I I thought that you you didn't dream in comas, and maybe that is true, but that still it it's it's indie. It has that weird fantasy quality about it, you know. Like whenever you listen to indie music, like really good, well thought out indie music, it's creative, but it's also whimsical and it has that kind of unexplainable feature about it that unexplainable quality where like like if you listen to vampire weekend or someone just totally out of left field like at first your experience is like i don't know what's going on but then you, you learn like that's what's so appealing about it like it's just creative for the sake of being creative and i love that about this game especially if you play it and you immerse yourself in it you play it in a dark room with the the lights out um 
and with headphones on or whatever, you know, just immerse yourself in this game because it's so well thought out. Just the whole package, like the music is great, the sound effects are great. Even though he made him with his mouth, like come on, and the just the atmosphere is really, really set. And whether it's a, a horror game or it's some other kind of game, you know, the ability to create an atmosphere is so important, you know, and I love that about this game. Um, hats off to you, Atmosphere. Um, not Atmosphere. Atmos Games. Um, anyway, uh, thank you so much for, for watching. Please do not leave this page without liking, subscribing, or commenting. Thanks so much.